This is a casket in which precious stones are collected. These are the lines from the most popular works of Persian literature, the Gulistan, the Rose Garden, the author of which is the great poet Mushrafeddin Muslik Saadi. This technique of decorating the binding appeared in the 15th century in Herat. Possibly, the Chinese liqueur art influenced on decorating objects with liqueur. And in the Timurid era, it began gaining popularity and remained in fashion until the 19th century. The Gulistan by Sadi was written in the middle of the 13th century in 1258. This work consists of short stories, the copy of which is kept in the Russian National Library, was later copied in Bukhara. The evidence is the inscription and the date of their creation in the 1566-1567 is indicated in the miniatures. The Gulistan is a collection of short stories of instructive nature in which prose, often rhymed, is mixed with poetic passages. Written in extremely elegant language, it is considered one of the brightest examples of Persian classical literature. The first miniature illustrates the story of how a certain ruler went on a boat trip on a ship, and he had a slave who had not previously gone to the sea and he was terribly frightened. He huddled in a corner of a ship, trembling and spoiling everyone's impression of the voyage. The shah ordered to throw him overboard. The slave began drowning. Then he was dragged onto the deck by hair, and he was already satisfied with safety. He sat on the deck and no longer pestered anyone with his fears, screams, crying, and so on. There's an illustrated story of wrestler and an apprentice. The apprentice thought he had suppressed his master, but then a contest was held in the presence of the ruler, and the old fighter, he was an old stager, did not reveal anything to his student from his tricks and hit him with one of those tricks that were unknown to him. This is exactly the moment depicted there. Each of the masterpieces of book art has its own history and destiny. This copy of Saudi was once in the library of Babur Sultan Jahangir. The evidence is the inscription Rathuran ibn Jahangir Padishah. Researchers believe that the entry was made by Shah Jahan, the heir of the Jahangir, who bore the name Huran before his coronation. This entry was just written by his hand. The Gulistan, in his regard, an essay written in the 13th century, became a model for subsequent authors. And in the same style, for example, the Bakristan was written, the work by Abdurrahman Jami. That is, imitations of the Gulistan were written later as well, because there is one of the greatest authors who created a work that became a model for future generations. The Gulistan by Saadi was copied in Bukhara for a certain Hoja Kamaluddin, who was a vizier under the Shaibanids. Hoja Kamaluddin, about whom, in principle, nothing is written in historical sources, nevertheless is the person for whom this manuscript was made. And already in the 19th century, this folio was in a small but very valuable collection of Lieutenant General Count Ivan Simonich, who was Russian minister proportionary at the Persian court in 1832-38. In 1864, his heir sold the collection to the Russian Imperial Library.